Hi friends, welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I'm going to show you two simple ways to create awesome YouTube intros, one using CapCut and the other using Canva. Whether you're just starting your channel or are looking to upgrade your style, these methods will help you create intros that stand out. So let's dive right in. First, let's start with CapCut. Open your browser and head over to pixabay.com. In the search bar, type intro and switch to the movie section. Here, you'll find a variety of free intro templates to choose from. Once you've found the intro you like, download it and import it into CapCut. Click on the intro to add it to your timeline. Move the playhead to a spot where there's space to add your text or logo. Go to the text section and select add heading. Adjust the length of the text layer so it matches your intro. Now go to basic and choose a font that fits your brand style. Adjust the text size and place it in the middle. Add some glow effects to make the text pop. Adjust to your liking. Next, head to the animations tab, select in animations and choose the open effect. Adjust the motion duration to your liking and don't forget to write your desired text. And here's the result. Looks professional, right? You can find free intro sounds on sites like Mixkit and Pixabay. They both have an incredible selection of royalty-free music that's perfect for YouTube videos. Now let's move on to Canva. Open the Canva web app and type YouTube intro into the search bar. Choose Canva templates. If you're like me and using the free version, make sure to pick a template marked as free. Just click on it. Choose Customize this template. Once inside the editor, customize the template to match your channel's branding. Add your channel name, tweak the colors, and adjust the animations. And here's what you get, a sleek, personalized intro made in minutes. So there you have it, two simple ways to create stunning YouTube intros using CapCut and Canva. Which one will you try first? Let me know in the comments below. If you found this tutorial helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, and hit that notification bell for more tips and tricks. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.